Hello everyone, I'm Brandon Dilworth. Welcome to the Brandon Dilworth Show. You know, I'm actually trying a new news format just to make it a little more lively in this mug. So with that said, if you're not familiar with the show, I got news, interesting ways to entertain you. So let's get on with it right now. And now a special look at The Wife Beater Chronicles. This just in, the LAPD is investigating an incident at R&B singer Chris Brown's home. One of the attendants there was a former beauty queen, Bailey Coran, who claims that he pulled a gun on her. Chris Brown maintains his innocence, saying, quote, his character's been defaced. And really, he's been defaced a long time ago, you know, with that incident with Rihanna. So with that said, Chris Brown, he's been defaced since 2009. You're welcome. Remember a few Dilworth shows back that I talked about Ryan Lochte being locked out of the Olympics for a while? Well, that's not going to be the case, but he will be missing out on a 2017 World Championship because Ryan Lochte has been suspended by the U.S. Olympic Committee and the swimming team for 10 months. It just proves that if you want to get laid, you gotta pay. Well, this is uncalled for. A university teacher at a military academy in China is seen in this video right here slapping and kicking his students. The university has suspended the teacher, and I got a soundbite just for him. What can I say? Everyone has a plan to end up on the Brandon Dilworth show. That's gonna be it for the news, and now it's time to check out some videos from the hood. Now, if there are any men with girlfriends out there, I'd like to ask you a question. What would you do if your girl was cheating on you? Would you, one, take her back, two, call Maury for a lie detector test, or three, humiliate her on social media? Yeah, you know, I was gonna take care of her son, pay for all the shit, but you know what? She was cheating, bro. Cheating. Her ex hit her up. If you guess anything but number three, that was a lie. She ain't even embarrassed, bro. She ain't even embarrassed, dog. Yeah, get the out of here. Cheating. Yeah, here's hoping he'll find a girl who will treat him right and who he won't embarrass on Snapchat. Next up... You see how people are? Yeah. I just got my car and they talking about you hit their car. We have a girl who speaks so smart and keeps her language down even when she's upset. Yeah, you see how white people do? This fat mother is saying you hit the mother car. You. I don't know. You. Oh, never mind. Okay, okay, next next video, next video. Don't miss me with that. Miss me with that. When it comes to armpit removal, you have to weigh your benefits with your disadvantages. And here are some disadvantages. Number one, the tape's gonna hurt. And number two, and this is the biggest disadvantage of all, maybe it should have been listed first, your friend is gonna humiliate you by catching this on camera and posting it online. And that's why we love you here at the Brandon Dilworth Show. You know, baptism is a sacred thing, and it should not be taken lightly, but uh, it shouldn't be rushed. But apparently, this boy did not care. He was like, you know what? Miss me with the extra stuff? Just dive me in the water. <laughs> well, at least he's safe now. Impatiently. And before I put the final bow on this week's Brandon Dilworth Show, I have some things to remind you. You know, this latest Chris Brown incident surprises me. Actually, no it doesn't. I'm surprised he didn't use an umbrella though. You know, the umbrella. Ella. Ella. A. 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 
Uh, and Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. Now you know how it feels to be a laid punk. And now you're going to lay in your house. <laughs> you're going to get laid in your house. You're going to get laid in the bed. You all got laid in Rio. Now you're going to get laid in the house. <laughs> Don't get too laid. <laughs> at least not for at least not over 10 months. And this teacher from the military academy in China. Yeah, I'm glad you weren't my teacher back then. Because you would be in deep, deep trouble. I got a family that's coming down on you if you ever come here. But you're not gonna come here. You already suspended, so never mind. I'm just running my mouth here. I need some duct tape. That's gonna be it for the Brando Show, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. It's been a blessing being in your screens, whether it be your phone, your computer, heck, even your TV. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, if you enjoyed this show, like, comment, share, and sub freaking scribe. Please freaking do it. I hope you enjoyed this show, especially after I changed my format of news. Feel me? <laughs> I'm also on Instagram at doof.brandon, Tumblr, Brandon Doof .tumblr com. That's it for me, ladies and gentlemen. Until we meet again, love God. Stay awesome. Goodbye, everyone. Hello, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Brandon Doof Show. If you want more of the Brandon Doof Show, make sure you click the annotation on the left. And if you want Reaction Central, click the annotation on the right. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at doof.brand, Tumblr, Brandon .tumblr com. That's it for me, ladies and gentlemen. Love God. Stay awesome.